Hi everyone, it's Jodie here. I thought I'd introduce you to a very special member of our team today. Now this is somebody that you probably hear in the backgrounds of our videos quite a lot. This is Benji. He is our three, almost four year old resident budgie here at HQ. He is in this big enclosure here in our main offices and he has the Luminize Shade Dweller Max lamp above him, which you can tell he absolutely loves to sit and perch under. Also in his enclosure, he has these Havistat natural tea tree branches, which create some great perches for their little feet. Now I've got my glasses on, you know it's going to get sciency. So birds actually benefit from UV just as much as reptiles do. In fact, they are both tetrachromats, which means they have a fourth cone cell in their eye. Now we as humans are trichromats, we have three cone cells in our eye, and we can see around one million colours in total. Tetrachromats, so four cone cells, can actually see 100 million colours. So these animals can experience things that we would never even dream of. So why is any of this actually important? These birds have a biological need to see these colours. It especially helps with breeding and feeding. With breeding, a lot of birds seem monomorphic to us, which means we can't tell the difference in sex just by looking at them. This isn't the case for birds. Under natural unfiltered daylight, birds can see fluorescent markers that appear on the feathers and the face. If you take a look at these two photos here, this one isn't under a black light, this one is, and the bird's beak appears to be glowing here. This is so birds can tell the difference. These fluorescent markers can also help with age, health, breeding condition and helps birds select the strongest mate. It also helps with feeding as the most ripened fruit gives off almost a fluorescent neon sign saying, look, I'm here ready to eat in the dense foliage. So birds this way can come down, find their food easier and get a larger meal.